over the last years, the European Union and its member states have already made a lot of progress in making public administrations more inclusive, competitive and citizen-centric through the implementation of the e-government action plan. Today, 58% of European citizens choose to get in touch with their public administration online and the overall online availability of public services is at 82%. But the digital transformation of government requires constant efforts when it comes to online processes. Many citizens are reluctant to use electronic payment services. Others are worried by online disinformation and what it does to our democracy. These examples show why trust is essential for any digital economy and society. On the 29th of September, we'll take an important step forward towards a safer and more trustworthy environment. On this date, the EIDAS regulation on electronic identification enters fully into force across the European Union. This means that electronic IDs recognized by a member state, such as national EID cards, bank cards or other types of electronic identification credentials, can also be used in other member states. Allow me an example. Social media platforms typically require a certain age for users to be admitted. A citizen who is interested in using this platform can now request an authentication service to verify that she does fulfill the platform's age requirements. Most importantly, beyond this verif verification, no personal data will be transmitted, such as, for example, the exact age. Furthermore, citizens and companies will be able to carry out secure cross-border electronic transactions, hence taking full advantage of their rights across the European Union, from the enrollment in a foreign university to accessing electronic health records or registering a business. Even opening a bank account in another member state without being physically present will become a reality. Overall, EIDAS creates a European internal market for cross-border electronic trust services, such as electronic signatures, electronic seals, timestamps, electronic delivery services and website authentication. I'm convinced that by joining our efforts, we will achieve the full digital transformation of public administrations in the benefit of all citizens and businesses in Europe.